We told you that uh, there is there are signs that the right is coming in for financial reform, but we also have a letter that says the left is concerned about the bill, the Dodd bill uh, on the floor as well. Joining us now to discuss this from Washington is Dean Baker. He is co-director uh, of the Center for Economic po and Policy Research. He was one of the first people, uh, you were one of the first people, Dean, to discuss the housing bubble back in 2002. Nobody listened to you then. Are you concerned, or at least not until it was too late, are you concerned that they're not going to listen to you now until it was too late as well? Well, you know, Washington follows its own course, and I think the issue is really the same, that what you have is the financial industry has enormous political power, and that was one reason no one wanted to hear someone saying that there were problems with what was going on, again, as early as 2002, but obviously they got much worse as the housing bubble grew. And right now, I think there's still not a lot of interest in really hearing serious comments about why this financial reform might not be the best mechanism to prevent a further crisis because basically they're responding to the Wall Street financial firms. Dean, what is missing big time in your view that would prevent a future financial crisis like the one we just lived through? Well, I don't think there's a simple thing. There's a couple points I always raise front and center. First of all, the, our, our regulators had the authority. They didn't use it. So Ben Bernanke, Alan Greenspan on down, they had the authority they needed to crack down on the abuses in the financial industry and first and foremost crack down on the housing bubble. But they looked the other way and they said everything's fine. I think that's important to note because it's never going to be easy for a regulator to tell a Goldman Sachs, a, a Citigroup, whoever it might be, that you can't do what's making you lots of money. And what we had here was we had Bernanke mess up about as bad as you can. Greenspan deserves more blame, but Bernanke was by his side since 2002. And we said, heck of a job, Ben, and we reappointed him. So unless we make it so regulators know, if you don't crack down, you lose your job. You face consequences. Well, next time it's going to be very hard to see why the regulators are going to take the hard move and crack down on the financial industry. Hey, hey, so Dean that's one... Yeah, go ahead. Let me just say, you know, you wrote this letter uh, addressed to Harry Reid and Mitch McConnell with a number of really the biggest minds, uh, uh, at least in academia here. You have Robert Reich, uh, you have Josh Rosner, Jim Chanos, I guess from Wall, Wall Street as well, making suggestions as simple as uh, requiring the ratings agencies to be held to the same standards uh, as other market participants or increasing capital uh, requirements that everyone has talked about, uh, eliminating too big to fail. They're, they seem like no-brainers. Why isn't this getting so so much more traction. Why is it missing from the legislation that's already there? Well, again, I think it is the power of the financial industry. A lot of the what seem obvious moves don't get put in there because basically the financial industry wants the day after regulation things to look like they did the day before uh, regulatory reform. And unfortunately, I think to a very large extent that will be the case. Again, there are some good things in this bill, particularly the Consumer Financial Products Protection Agency or Bureau if it's in the Fed. It's certainly a good thing. There's some other measures. We'll have right. more exchange. But, but it's not going to change Dean, the system. Dean, got 10 seconds left here. What's everybody so afraid? of it's so obvious to you and many others what's everybody afraid of here the power of Wall Street they they give an awful lot of campaign contributions both political parties no one wants to cross them all right we're gonna leave it on that note hey Dean good to get some basic. time with you money it is pretty Take basic care, sounds like we're all doomed all Th right thanks very much Dean